I'm going to be doing a uh, smoothie video and you know if this is the best green smoothie that you'll ever have and benefit wise for your health it's pretty great um, and so oh yeah happy new year I uh, hope all of you had a good time doing that so the ingredients that we have here is first off spinach a delightful bunch and then we have some kiwis here in this little tiny platter and then we have almond milk because your girl is lactose intolerant what's up and then uh, we have our blender and then if you're wondering what this is this is my lucky kombucha is it a tea according to wikipedia kombucha is a fermented yes. okay this is a tea it's really good for you a lot of probiotics in it because it is fermented um and it's uh, yeah mm -hmm. kombucha culture black tea green tea kiwi juice oh kiwi juice that's what's in here oh my gosh fresh pressed ginger and 100% love. Wow, who doesn't like that? Okay, so this is great. I watched on um, Dr. Mike's channel that, you know, probiotics is a huge thing. You really need it. You need to keep your digestive uh, bacteria or whatever it's called really healthy because it actually controls your mood um, and your overall health with other things and can help prevent a lot of diseases. So you should go look into that because that's really good. And, you know, like kimchi, uh, what was it, sauerkraut, yogurt, those are really great sources. Also, I think, personally, kombucha is great too. Mmm, I heard a dog. Okay, so, I like to give this a little Mama. shake. Almond milk is a great alternative Mama. for if you are lactose intolerant or you're vegan. Um, it's good for you. I've heard in some cases that it actually has more calcium. I don't know how factual that is. I just drink it because I have to. I usually get the 30 cal 30 calorie unsweetened one, but today we have the 60 calorie original, which I used to get. That's, we're throwing it back today. Okay, so I'm going to add to my blender roughly. Actually, I'll do this last. I always tell by doing this. If you want exact measurements, I'll give you exact measurements. Roughly two handfuls of uh, spinach, which is great, and I'll tell you why. Hey Google! Spinach is rich in vitamins A, C and K, magnesium, iron and manganese. Eating this leafy green veggie may benefit eye health, reduce oxidative stress and reduce blood pressure levels among other health functions. So, spinach is great. If you want an exact measurement, two cups. So, but for me, it's about, it's about two handfuls. And I'm gonna go wash that. One spinach. Next thing that we have are our kiwis. What are the benefits of kiwi? On the website healthline.com, they say, kiwis are small fruits that pack a lot of flavor and plenty of health benefits. Their green flesh is sweet and tangy. It's yeah. also full of nutrients like vitamin C, vitamin K, mm. vitamin E, folate, and potassium. They also have a lot of antioxidants and are a good source of fiber. Okay, so um, these things are just great for you. I was reading on my phone, kiwis may actually uh, help treat asthma, uh, aids in digestion, it boosts your immune system, it helps prevent uh, you from being prone to getting sick, and manages your blood pressure, reduces blood clotting. A banana, you can put in half a banana. These things are pretty sweet, so if you just want half a banana, then you can do that. Um, you can add an apple, you can add an orange, orange juice. Um, and then, I also forgot, but I add um, frozen blueberries. are jam-packed with uh, antioxidants, which is great for you. And it says about one cup is the serving size. So I'm gonna roughly pour it in, but I just, I gave you that serving size if you wanted to know. So I'm just gonna roughly pour in that much. And then 
we're going to add roughly about a cup to this mixture. And it's looking like it needs more than a cup, yeah. I mean, you can either add more, but I just like to add the rest with water. Um, this thing is great for a pre-workout, a post-workout. Um, it's jam-packed with a bunch of vitamins, a bunch of nutrients, a bunch of health benefits. Although, um, if you wanted protein, you could do um, protein powders, peanut butter. You could also add nuts in here. Nuts are great as a natural fat. Then you could add avocados. That's a great source of fat as well for your body. It's the good kind of fat, not the bad kind of fat. Um, fats. Good fats are great in long-term energy storage. So you want a mix of that as well as carbohydrates, which is short-term energy storage. Um, and you want a mix of those when you're running marathons or if you're going to work out, you're going to use that short, depending on how hard your workout is, you're going to use that short energy up pretty fast and then it will start going into your uh, long-term energy storage, which is your fats. So, um, you could also add oats as a source of carbohydrates. Um, I do like oatmeal and like grinding it up in the food processor because oatmeal is just great for you. And the reason for that is because, hey Google! On the website healthline.com, they say, they're a gluten-free whole grain and a great source of important vitamins, minerals, fiber, and antioxidants. Studies show that oats and oatmeal have many health benefits. These include weight loss, lower blood sugar levels, and a reduced risk of heart disease. If you want to have um, this as for breakfast or as a more hearty uh, pre-workout type of thing, you add your oats. You can add a little bit of your nuts. They say around a handful of almonds you can eat or you can add or do half a handful if you don't want too many almonds. I don't know, nuts. Um, and that is really good as a source of fat. Or those avocados and you can't even taste the avocado when you blend it up into a smoothie which is really good let's turn this thing on really good delicious um, if you want it sweeter you can add a banana or you can add some honey um, I was reading some controversial things about agave so I don't think I'll recommend that to you or you can just add a little bit more fruits hope you guys enjoyed I hope to see you in the next video. All right, bye guys.